What's going to be the next hot blockchain network that comes onto the scene that everybody and their brother is going to be talking about? See, this happens pretty much every single crypto cycle. A new blockchain hits the scene that captures a ton of mindshare and absolutely blows up. We've seen this in the past with things like Solana, Polygon, Binance Smart Chain, Sui. And in this video, I want to talk about a new blockchain network that has just launched that has a ton of potential to change the game and absolutely blow up. I'm going to explain exactly what it is in this video today and why you should pay attention to this, you know, as a blockchain developer myself who works with this technology on a daily basis. So if you're new around here, hey, I'm Gregory, and on this channel, I turn you into a blockchain master. So if that's something that you're interested in, then smash that like button down below and subscribe. And if you want to see how to take advantage of this game-changing technology, I can show you how to increase your income by becoming a blockchain developer, step-by-step from start to finish, over at adaptiversity.com forward slash bootcamp. Alright, so let's get into this. So obviously nothing I'm saying in this video is designed to be financial advice. I'm not telling you to buy or sell or hold any cryptocurrency based on this information. But let's talk about this new blockchain network that just launched that I believe has a ton of potential. So what is it? Well, it's Unichain. Okay, so what is that? Well, it's a brand new blockchain network that's released by none other than Uniswap Labs, the creator of the most popular exchange out there, Uniswap. Now, note that I said this is a blockchain network. It's not necessarily a new layer one blockchain in and of itself. I'll explain that here in a second but it does have a cryptocurrency associated with it, you know, the Uni token. And I'll explain how that fits into this new Uni chain in this video. But I believe this is a huge deal for three major reasons, which I'm going to outline clearly in this video. So make sure you stick around. But let's start for the basics about clearly defining exactly what Uni chain is. Okay, so this is a new blockchain network, again, released by the creators of Uniswap, the most popular decentralized cryptocurrency exchange out there. And basically, it is a general purpose layer two blockchain right now that promises to be a lot more uh, that's built on top of the Ethereum platform. So let me explain that. So you may have heard, you know, of the problems with Ethereum or maybe you've experienced yourself. You know, people say it's too slow. It's too expensive to use uh, for mass adoption. But that's just the Ethereum layer one blockchain itself. So Ethereum's roadmap includes layer two scaling solutions where basically you build a separate environment on top of Ethereum called a layer two, where you still pay the gas fees in Ether, but those transactions are much faster and much cheaper, and it piggybacks on top of Ethereum, and those transactions are rolled up and then settled back on the main chain. You might have heard of other networks like Base or Arbitrum or Optimism, and now Uniswap has launched their network, Unichain, at the top of this list, okay? So right now, it is a general purpose layer two, which means anybody can deploy an application to it. You know, Uniswap's going to run on top of it as well. You're going to pay the gas fees in ETH. It's fast, cheap transactions, and those get settled back on the Ethereum main chain. But that's just the beginning, okay? There's actually a lot more to this on the roadmap, and that's where I believe the big game changer comes into play. So let me get in my three points on why this is such a big deal. So point number one is that this is actually going to be a new implementation that's going to solve one of the biggest problems for these layer two blockchain networks. Let me explain. So Unichain is built with the Optimism Superchain, which basically is going to be an aggregator of a lot of different blockchain networks where you can use a single app and it can talk to multiple different blockchains at the exact same time. This is massive because right now, you know, you have a problem. With things like Uniswap, yeah, you can use it, you can connect your wallet, and you can do a swap on one chain, and then you can switch networks in your wallet to do a swap on a different chain, but you have to move funds from one chain to another anytime that you want to move these different ecosystems. It can be a real pain in the butt, okay? Not to mention the fact that now that we have all these different layer twos out there, all these different blockchain networks that the liquidity for each application and all the apps are spread across, you know, a dozen or so different networks, okay? So what this can do, not right now, but as it gets developed, is that all that stuff can be sort of aggregated into one place. So when you're using this, you could actually be using an application, you know, with this new technology, and it could actually take advantage of all these different blockchains in the background without the user having to be aware of it. They don't have to switch chains in their wallet. They don't have to worry about, is there money on this chain? Is there money on that chain? Is the app on this chain is on that chain? And you don't have to move in between them. You can basically use everything in one place and it can aggregate it all to reduce this fragmentation problem. 
So basically, it can be a network where things are fast, they're cheap, and you've got access to pretty much everything. You've got the keys to the kingdom, and this is a huge deal in my opinion. If they can really crack this, it'll be a huge sticking point for this technology. So point number two is this actually creates a way for people who hold something like the Uniswap token to get some value from usage of the application itself, okay, or the chain itself. So let me explain what I mean by that. Uh, in my last video, go check that out if you haven't already, I talked about a future where we could be bringing things like, you know, stocks on the blockchain, real world assets, all these types of things to bring a ton of outside demand to crypto. And if we have applications where people can hold tokens, utility coins that, you know, get a portion of the fees from that activity, and even from cryptocurrency trading, that can be a recipe for essentially this tech, you know, the, the coins themselves having some cash flow to them where they can really appreciate value on their own, regardless of what's happening across the broader crypto cycle over time as this demand increases and as that utility value is there. Okay, it's more of a fundamental value to the cryptocurrencies in that case, kind of like a stock, not just a speculative crypto coin that you're kind of just hoping goes up that more people will buy. So let me explain why that's a huge deal for this particular use case. So the Uniswap token has been around for some time and really up until this point, it's mostly been a governance token. So you can hold it, you can vote on what happens with the protocol, okay? But most people don't really care that much about that. Um, they'd much rather have a token that has essentially a fee switch where they can get a cut of the trading fees that actually happen on Uniswap because it's got such massive trading volume, okay? And we've seen people try to talk about this for quite some time, but you know the regulatory environment has not been very favorable to that, all right? But what this does, it can kind of circumvent that a little bit and almost act as a fee switch for the Uniswap uh, protocol and the token itself. Let me explain why. So basically, with the new Uni chain that's come out, um, people can stake the Uni coins, okay, and actually get a portion of the fees paid to the network where th everything is running, okay? So you're not necessarily getting paid directly from the trading fees that happen on Uniswap, but Uniswap is probably going to be the largest uh, application on this network, okay? It's the largest on most Ethereum layer twos. And essentially, you know, Uniswap is gonna be incentivized to draw people to that particular chain to also get a portion of these fees. So if a lot of swaps take place on Uniswap through the Uni chain, then the Uni token holders can actually get benefits by, you know, capturing a portion of the fees by staking them that's going onto the network itself. Not necessarily trading fees to the application, but transaction fees that are going onto that chain. So essentially, it's a way for this token to actually have some value accrual to it by fees paid to the network, not necessarily trading fees, but can be a huge proponent uh, for the coming, you know, decentralized finance renaissance that's taking place and also the real world assets that are moving on the chain that can all be filtered through protocols and chains just like this. All right, the final big reason why I think this is such a big deal is really just has to do with people's behavior instead of crypto. So, you know, pretty much every cycle, like I was saying, new technology hits the scene and speculators want to try to get in on the new thing early. And I do think there's going to have a, a big effect for that with a chain just like this that already has an existing token. OK, people and their brother always want to know what's the next hot thing. What can I get on, uh, you know, at the ground floor at low valuations, especially during a bull market? And I think for that reason, uh, that sort of sets the stage for this to perform well and actually get some traction. All right, so what can you do with Unichain today and how can you actually use it if you want to test it out, okay? Well, basically, um, Unichain is live in its general purpose layer two form. Again, we don't have this total aggregation effect like I was talking about that's coming on the roadmap. But as a user, you know, you can move assets using the bridge. Uh, you can do it through the Uniswap web page or a wallet. You can do things like launch tokens on it by deploying a contract manually or using the coin launcher. You can start using applications on it today, okay? You can see all the different applications that are currently live on top of Unichain, things like Across, you know, Bungie, Bunny, and so many other things which you can see on this page. And so finally, I want to talk to the developers watching this video. So if you are a developer or you're an aspiring developer, okay, there's always lots of opportunity anytime new chains and environments launch like this. That's because people want to be the first to colonize new ecosystems just like this and you know uniswap the uni the uni chain is basically just you know fresh land for developers to do that so basically you if you want to see the uh how you can get started today as a developer you can look at the uh documentation here for uni chain you can see how to start deploying applications how you can create uniswap version 4 hooks to basically create plug and play apps that work with uniswap 
and also how to build with stable coins, things like uh, USDC and CCTP to integrate these into your applications. All right, so that's an overview of Unichain that has just launched and where this is going in the future and what the potential is for this technology. So trust me, you wanna pay attention to this. So let me know what you think down in the comment section below. Have you heard about Unichain? Are you excited about this? I wanna hear from you. And whenever you're finished leaving your comment, make sure you smash that like button down below and subscribe. And if you're as fascinated with this technology and you wanna get directly involved in blockchain, then what's the absolute best way to do that? Well, you can go to my YouTube homepage. You can see my free courses there. They're like Udemy courses, but they're totally free. And if you like those videos and you wanna take the next step, or hey, maybe you wanna take a master shortcut entirely, I can show you how to become a blockchain master step-by-step start to finish, how to increase your income by becoming a blockchain developer over at dappdiversity.com forward slash bootcamp. You really don't have to be an expert to get started today. I've helped people with zero coding experience become real world blockchain developers in a matter of months. So that's all I've got. And until next time, thanks for watching Dappy Diversity.